I was looking for new ideas, different types of games to showcase on Freeplay Arcade, when my friend suggested I look into visual novels. I did, and it was a good suggestion, because I stumbled onto Locke's Reigns, The Shadows That Run Alongside Our Car. This visual novel was made over four days using a tool called RenPy, a free, open-source tool intended specifically for the creation of visual novels and other dialogue-centric games. Since this experience is literally all about the story, I'm going to try editing around anything that might spoil it, but I would still like to quote the premise as it is written on the Itch.io page. The road is long. Two strangers sit side by side as night falls over. The car speeds down the open highway. Without a soul around them, everything else seems to slip away. On a journey to no one knows where, all they have is words and time. And that time is dwindling fast. The shadows are chasing. Although the events that led to being in the car are important, at the end of the day, this is a story about two people who know nothing about each other, driving through the night, and the kinds of conversations people have when there's really nowhere else to go. At the beginning, the player needs to pick which character's perspective they're going to experience, and the story presents several opportunities to make dialogue decisions for that character which influence the outcome. In total, there are six endings to the story, and I'm not going to show you any of them. You're just going to have to experience them for yourself. The Shadows That Run Alongside Our Car takes roughly 20 to 30 minutes to experience once, and is definitely a story worth exploring from multiple perspectives. So why not spend a single evening with two strangers in a car and find out why this story is so compelling? If you like this episode of Freeplay Arcade, please consider subscribing and sharing. I have new episodes every week. Also, if there are any free indie games you'd like to see me cover in Freeplay Arcade, leave a comment below or shoot me a tweet. Thanks for watching.